you guys see a quadratic or something that is possibly factorable, you should probably try to factor it. Also, when you see a rational expression, you should probably try to see if you could simplify it by dividing out terms, right? That's what we talked about on your quiz about discontinuities and all that kind of stuff. Um, but either way, so we need to find the value of x. Now, regardless, we're going to find the same process, right? If these functions are continuous or not, they're going to be continuous or not when um, at what value? x equals 7, x equals 2. What value are they going to be either continuous or not continuous at? 1, right? But we want to find the value k that makes them continuous. Now, the problem is we can't plug 1 into this equation. We can't set these equal to each other. That's the idea. That's what you want to do. Set them equal to each other, just like we did over there, right? And then plug it in. But the problem is plug 1 into here. 1 squared is 1. Negative 5 times 1 is negative 5 plus 4. That gets to 0. You can't have 0 in the denominator, right? So plugging in 1 doesn't work, at least right now. But if I recognize, oh, I have a quadratic. Well, what? let me try to factor that real quick. If I maybe try to factor that, that becomes x minus 1 over what two numbers? Multiply to give me 4, add to give me negative 5. x minus 1 times x minus 4. Oh, and then I could divide this out. That means that x equals 1 is actually a, starts with an h and rhymes with pull. It's a whole. Right? And we did a and we did one and we did a function like that that creates a whole. So what we end up with, the simplified version here, is 1 over x minus 4. So now could I set 1 over x minus 4 and then equal that to um, k? And now can I plug in at x equals 1? Can now can I plug in 1? Yes. yes. And when you go ahead and plug in 1, you get 1 negative 3. So the value k that makes the function continuous is negative 1 third. Okay. And there you go. So always look to simplify, simplify, simplify. And when you're confused, simplify. And you know and when you know what you're doing, simplify.